So Wes, um, can you tell us a little about the charity you're working for here today? Well, the charity is uh, Skyline Tigers, and um, it's, it's a great organization. And, and one thing that I know about the board of directors as well as the parents, they're trying to do all that they can in uh, trying to help the youth. And well, as long as they're about the youth, that's what CEI, Celebrity Events, is about. It's about trying to help those particular charities and organizations who are really, really trying to help the kids. It's about the kids, bottom line. And that's been something that uh, has been a part of my life, especially as after turning pro. That's the thing that I've always wanted to do is reach back, give something back. San Diego has always been like a second home to me, so I feel the need uh, and the burning desire to try and get out into the community and do all I can to help an organization like Skyline. Right. What, what uh, other interests are you into these days? Well, basically I, I have two companies. Celebrity Events is, is about youth, primarily it's about charities, it's charity driven, and then uh, JGI, Joe Group International, we're about commodities and we're, we're trying to westernize uh, the culture in uh, South Africa, and that's something that we're doing. Uh, we want to uh, build an infrastructure uh, over there, and part of what we do in terms of uh, the funds that we make there will also be uh, the parent company to CEI, so it'll allow us to continue to give back to charities like uh, Skyline Youth Tigers to, so they can better service those youth and continue to teach them life skills. Sure. And just one football question. Uh, <laughs> how would you compare your glory days with Air Coriel to today's game? Well, that's part of the biggest reason why I'm here. I think the, the glory days for me and what we were able to do, we were so far ahead of our time uh, as an offensive unit and the things that we were doing. The, the, the guys that I've been able to play with over the years here when I played, uh, I will never forget. I mean, they really made me. I was in New Orleans, of course, and even though I, I was playing with a great quarterback in Archie Manning, uh, and there's some great players there, not until I got here was I able to actually maximize what the good Lord had to store upon me. And so when I look at the charges of today, sometimes I often think about, you know, the Coriel days. Uh, even when I used to see the greatest show on turf, the St. Louis Rams, when Al Sanders was there, it was always a comparison to what we were able to do here in St. Diego. So I'm, you know, when I look back at it, I, I always think that there is a, a, a heartbeat of the community of San Diego about the Coriel days. Thanks very much.